Yo guys, what is going on? My name is Vexilate. You can call me Nick, and today we are bringing you the first of three fight simulations for UFC 273, a complete banger of a card. We're going to be starting off with Hamza Shemaya versus Gilbert Burns, and I usually don't do fight simulations for non-title fights, but this fight is just too much of a banger. This is way too good of a fight to not simulate, because you have the hottest prospect, which in my opinion, he still is that, just a prospect, in UFC today, you know, he's up there with the ranks of like Sean O'Malley, his biggest prospect, you know, uh, Ilya Taporia, Patty the Batty. He's on like that level of prospect. This is his biggest competition yet in Gilbert Burns. His fight most recently, Hamza Shamayev fought Li Jing Liang, and he was a huge favorite in that fight. And a lot of people think that Li Jing Liang was going to give him some problems, but he did not. There was no resistance from Li Jing Liang. Hamza was able to do whatever he wanted with him, but Gilbert Burns is a whole nother level than Li Jing Liang. You know, Gilbert Burns may be one of the best jujitsu artists in the game right now. You know, he's got that five round fight experience. He's got that, you know, in cage time experience. You know, he's got that overcoming adversity experience. He's got the experience over Hamza Shemaev, undeniably. But Hamza Shemaev is not going to show respect to Gilbert Burns. He's going to come out after it in this fight he is hungry he is gonna try to kill Gilbert Burns he's gonna walk in there he might try to take his head off he might try to wrestle with him and that's the thing if Hamza tries to wrestle maybe he might get caught in a submission or he might try to strike and you know crack that chin of Gilbert Gilbert Burns doesn't always have the best chin let me just get my thumbnail right here Gilbert Burns got stopped by Kamaru Usman's jabs and I know that Usman is a powerful puncher but Kamaro Usman and Shemaev are somewhat equal in power. We've seen Hamza Shemaev get some crazy, crazy knockouts like uh, uh, MG3, I think his name is. I, I can't remember his full name. But uh, Hamza Shemaev is undefeated so far. He is the big favorite in this fight. But I don't think it should be that big of a favorite. There's just so many unanswered questions. Is We don't know how the chin of Hamza Shemaev looks. We don't know if he's going to be able to survive submission attempts from the bottom from Gilbert Burns. Things like that. We got to find... There's so many answers just because he doesn't have a whole lot of in-cage time in the UFC yet. Just because he finishes his fight so quickly. There's a lot of things about Hamza that we don't know. And this fight is going to test Hamza Shemaev and basically determine the future of the welterweight division. Gets a takedown immediately into a guillotine. No way. Oh my god, but he countered it. Under a minute in, shot for a takedown, landed in a guillotine, and transitions to an arm triangle. Can he get it? Oh, it's close, but it's looking like Gilbert's going to be able to escape. Maybe. It's still close. It's still close. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Hamza Shemaev. Puts him to sleep. He didn't tap. He put him to sleep. Questions are answered. Hamza Shemaev submits Gilbert Burns in like under a minute. This, oh my God, that was insane. I could see something crazy like this happening in real life. That was a great simulation. Short, but geez, was that crazy. Can this happen? Can Hamza Shemaev finish Gilbert Burns like this? I don't know. I don't know, but I think this is one of the best simulations I could have asked for given this fight. So let me know. What did you guys think in the comments below? Uh, who do you think is going to win? What do you think of the simulation? Let me know. Thank you guys for watching. You know all that YouTube junk. Like, comment, share, yada, yada, yada. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next simulation. Aljamain Sterling versus Peter Jan. See you there.